and now I'm in my way to check a GE refrigerator not cooling at all so we're gonna go ahead and find out what's going on I just got here to the house what's going on um, if it's not cooling at all that sounds like it could be either the compressor compressor relay or the most common one which is the uh, main computer board now this computer board used to be about hundred and thirty dollars no it was about eighty nine dollars and now this control board's price raised up to almost two hundred and fifty dollars so let me go and check it out what's going on i'm gonna give you an update in a little bit okay guys uh, i just checked the ge refrigerator and i found that it needs a new computer board and it's very simple to notify when it's bored because you will be able to see those capacitors popping out or the two green dials i don't know what's the name of it these two green pieces they turn yellow when the main control board is is going bad or the main control is already not working uh, properly is these two green things when the is not giving any power to the digits on the display board that means that these capacitors right here are bad so i'm gonna come back tomorrow and install a new board and hopefully that solves the problem again you can check the wiring underneath of the uh, freezer door right here or you can check the wiring sometimes the wiring it's on the uh, top of the freezer door hinges which is right here so again guys um, I'm gonna come back tomorrow and finish in the installation of the main computer board all right guys this is a day two of finishing the repair on the GE side-by-side -side refrigerator now I'm on my way to install the main computer board which I got it right here now you got to keep in mind that this one has a car charge so you you will have to leave the old box where this one comes from and put the old one in and give it to where you got it from if you buying it from a part supplier now if you are buying it on amazon you don't need to return the board uh i believe so just go ahead and you know get it online and you avoid this now i got this on my corn my part supplier and i have to return the old board and also the box they have to put the old board on the new box for me to get my core charge fee back okay and by the way it's 60 dollars core charge and yeah i'm going right here to install the main computer board and hopefully this good this is going to be a in and out um repair you know it's probably going to take about five ten minutes if you're a homeowner and fixing your refrigerator by yourself you can save a lot of money by doing it um, this way and buy the board on Amazon. I believe it's about 200 and some dollars or less than 200. I don't know the price always change But um, yeah, you can save money by doing it yourself Or if you are a technician and doing this repair, you know, you already know what to do. So um, I'm gonna go in and install this new board and I'm gonna give you an update after I finish the repair okay guys I just finished the repair for this GE side-by-side -side refrigerator and I replaced the main control board everything came on we got digits on the display board by the dispenser and everything came on but I wasn't hearing the condenser fan motor so I took the uh, back panel apart and the fan motor wasn't wasn't running I don't know if that has anything to do with the issue and why the board went bad but the only thing that i remember is that the customer said that the light 
went out because it was a storm or something and then that's when the refrigerator starts acting up and no digits and eventually it just started defrosting everything so uh, the only thing I did is disconnect the harness for the condenser fan motor plug it back again or just move it around and it started working so I believe it was just a miss connection on the um, on the harness and after I disconnect it plug it back again everything starts working fine I was going to you know remove the wiring and just scrape them and connect the wiring together but you know the harness started working fine and I, I move it around and it didn't fail anymore so that was it for this video guys if this video helped you in any way please give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and I see you on the next video bye